Well, all observers are agreed on this. It is the point where the competition gets really serious. Top teams now fielding their best available lineups in front of big, big crowds. A lot of noise, great expectation, and the sense that the possibility of silverware is at hand. This is a big chance. You're able to enjoy with us here some great scenes at this arena by the river. There is no venue quite like this one. So this is where we're up to in the quarterfinals. Already plenty enough to get the juices flowing. Well, look, when you reach this stage of the competition, you begin to think you can go the distance. Now, the big characters in either dressing room will be stressing the need to find whatever it takes to get through. Has everyone got the substance and character to make it happen? These are the questions that both of these sides have to answer today, and one side will obviously do it that bit better. It's got things on the way. Jim, who do you reckon is pivotal? Yeah, Leonardo Bonucci. He's as imposing as they come, Peter, and he knows just how to use his his physical attributes to make life difficult for attackers. He's also got a very good eye for a killer long ball, so don't be surprised if you see him launch a few counter-attacks for his team today. <laughs> I wonder whether that has anything to do with you being a defender once upon a time, Jim. Lingard plays it out to the flank. Ball's loose, who's getting there? Juan Bissaka plotting from out on the right. Great leap! Oh, he couldn't get the direction he needed. Juventus can defend those situations better by stopping the crosser at source. Pjanic gets wrestled off the ball. Ramsey. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. Goes for goal! Well, that is rather wayward. Kadira put absolutely everything he had into that. Maybe better look next time. Rashford but Tomine he's going after it just brushed off the ball there and it's Cristiano Ronaldo Cristiano Ronaldo he's left his man goes for the cross he's gone out for a throw in Maguire plays it forward. Brings it forward. Had a shot. Oh, wow! An absolute pile driver. About as smooth as it gets. The breakthrough strike. Juventus are looking strong on the break. Winning the ball in midfield is one thing, but it's the clever use of counter-attacking. That's the real highlight. Juventus have made their breakthrough, so can they build on it? Well, registering that crucial first goal has now given them... Cristiano Ronaldo! Oh, my word, my word, that is fantastic! He's got himself a peach 
touch of a goal. And already they're looking to run away with it. Absolutely thundered in. Keeper, no chance. Is it just me or did he make that look very, very easy? That was terrific skill and composure from him. He finished with such a prompt. Things starting to look very comfortable. Well, unsurprisingly, Peter, the opposition looked completely stunned. I'm not sure they can gather themselves. And back to base. Keeper's got good distance on that. One Bissaka. More than happy to take the muscular approach. Rabio. Well positioned to make that interception. And the half time whistle goes. Any opinion you'd like to express on the first half? Juventus are two up and everything is shaping nicely. The only criticism, it could have been three. Juventus in control at half time, 2 0. We're already back on the way here. Changes at the interval from either side. It's Rashford! It's off target and by quite a way. Well, they're being made to force the issue, but they need to be patient and, and a little more composed. Oh, it's open. It's one! Yes, it's in! And the second half is off. To a flyer. And that's it. That was always inevitable. We have got ourselves a game here. Well, I think they probably needed an early goal in this half just to give them the confidence and belief to push on and look for an equaliser. Played into the middle. Lindelof tries to get it forward quickly. Shoots! Big relief, it just needed better contact. Well, Peter, he clearly felt he was being invited to shoot and it wasn't the worst decision he could have made. And it's Lingard. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Ball has crossed the line, and it's a throw. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Dybala. Gets away from his opponent. To the up for the header! He's done well to get his head on that, but couldn't score. I have to commend the wing plate, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. Shaw. Shaw drives it forward. And it's Martial. Gets the better of his man. Cut out in the nick of time. <laughs> Manchester United making another change here. It's going to be a double change then. Repelled by the keeper. Up to meet it! He will be livid with himself. Rabio and here's Cristiano Ronaldo 
He'll hit it! Juventus are clearly looking to kill this game off. It's keeping the ball away from the other end, too. Decent progress down the left. That's Tweedy. Looking for a decent ball. He's had a shot! Not this time. Manchester United can defend those situations better by stopping the crosser at source. Juventus, the referee's awarded a free kick. <laughs> Tries a shot! Maguire really made the tough part look easy, and the easy part very complicated. Ramsey battles to win it back. And now the breakaway. And the defence can get it clear. Maguire. Manchester United. Rashford! He's pulled off a fine save. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeping. Oh, that is asking for trouble. And that's that. Juventus through to the last four. Just two more steps now. They have got a crack at it. Would you summarise what we've seen today then, Jim? Juventus have turned a, a win by one goal into round two. And they seem to have a personality that could win quite a few extra admirers. Four teams, we're down to the last four then, the penultimate round in this fine competition. The two teams ahead of us here have their eyes firmly fixed on the grand prize. They both believe it is within their compass. Having come this far, they're entitled to believe that. The competition has provided us with a lot of drama up to this point. And I'm sure there is plenty more to come before it reaches its ultimate climax. Stadio Jose Alvalade in Lisbon, a really impressive arena, named of course in honour of the founder of its occupants, Sporting Lisbon. So it's a straight shootout for the final, that's what we're going to see, there's no region you would rather be. Again, some may argue with justification as being harder than the final itself, Peter, I can certainly attest to that from my own experience. While you do everything to tell yourself you shouldn't get too ahead of things, it's actually harder than it seems. But it's looking like a terrific occasion here. Let's just hope we have a game to match all of this wonderful expectation. So it's away we go then. So Jim, who would you identify as the key man in this fixture? It ha Van der Beek! Right from the first whistle, they played with an energy that makes them good value for that early goal. There was to be only one outcome. Yeah, that's brilliant from him. Such a, a calm finish. Just pick your spot, don't think about what the keeper's going to do. Concentrate on what you have to do.
have made their breakthrough, so can they build on it? And here's Cristiano Ronaldo. It's Ramsey! Oh, he's really drilled it. Ramsey just couldn't steer it on target. Everything else was, was up there. Joel Feltman. Zayek. Ajax are playing with a pleasing width here, especially that front line. Is it working for you? Um, it's not movement for the sake of it, and yes, it is working for me. There's a purpose to, to create space. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Cristiano Ronaldo. He's left his man, going for goal! And in again! Dybala was quick to move in, keeper's handling wasn't great. Well, look, regardless of whether the keeper could have done better or not, Peter, that was all down to the excellent movement in getting into the right position to apply the final touch. That has certainly made things interesting. Yeah, for me, both sides are strong and well-matched, and I think you need to be a good player to be out there right now. Cristiano Ronaldo. Out to the right. Katira. Gets up to head it! Oh, and they really should have been made to pay. That's what all good teams do these days. Pressing from the front is highly effective. Zayek. He's put it on the right now. What's on? Gets away from his opponents. Played in by Zayek. Era. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Taliafico goes back to base. Keeper's got good distance on that. Up towards the front line. Matuidi gets into the right position to intercept. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Tadic. He could be in here. Tadic. Oh, that's a foul in a dangerous area. And no surprise, that's a booking. Well, the protest continues, but in the end, they are defending the indefensible. Well, it was deliberate, it was cynical, and you have to understand the frustration of, of being denied a clear opportunity, but it had to be done. Half time in the semi final. What it has been an even contest, as the scoreline suggests, and it has been more than decent to watch. So there was the first half. Well, for us neutrals, this is fantastic. If you're a fan from either side, it's unpleasant. And as for the managers, check your heart rate. It's been a really interesting game up to now, and the sides are predictably very well matched. Hoping perhaps for a little bit more from both parties in the second half, but as it stands, it's one each. And we're already into the second period. Talia Fico. Talia Fico. 
move. A really impressive run, which nearly went the whole way. Oh, look, his determination needed to be greater than the obstacle he was faced with, and it wasn't. Van der Beek. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. He'll try from distance. And the keeper's relieved to see that disappear wide. Cristiano Ronaldo probably tried a bit too hard then. He should have relied on technique as opposed to power. Blint drives it towards the front. Van der Beek. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. It's good progress. He's speculative strike. And that will sail harmlessly past. Well, it was hit with great power, Peter, but sadly, not great precision. Looks to bypass the midfield. Tadic not easily shrugged off the ball. Some good play on the left-hand side now to profit from it. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. Shoots! Oh, he's managed to miss it. Well, we could be headed for a scenario in which next goal is the winner. That chance could have been it too. to get it forward quickly Ajax couldn't do a whole lot with it there they could do with more sharpness in their passing yeah it's pretty obvious as to who was going to be taken off his energy levels began to to sag and he was never going to last until the final whistle and it's Tadic he ran himself into trouble there free kick given away Ref's been lenient here. I doubt he'll get too many more chances. Towering header! Oh, what a lovely delivery. It deserved better. In this game, you're always striving to, to gain an advantage or produce a surprise element to things. And the quicker the delivery, I think, the more chance you have. And they should have done better there. We are into stoppage time. So nothing between them in 90 minutes, and we are in for extra time. Yeah, no daylight between these two sides, but I have to say, neither side really did enough to find the winner. They just cancelled each other out. So a brief breather, and then extra time. He's caught him there, it's a free kick. That could spell trouble. Gets the better of his man. Ramsey in towards the middle. Uh, looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. And the referee has shown him a yellow card. Keeper sends it forward. Good running with the ball, can they build on it? Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. He gets past his man. He's had a shot! Belton goes looking. It's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Rabiot. Rabiot! Oh, should have put that away. Half-time, extra time. 
Well, there's plenty of potential for a final twist in this tale. I think there's bound to be some late drama in the final 15 minutes of this epic. And so the last chance to find a winner. It has been a slugfest. Significant blows landed, but still no knockouts. Belts one. It's all at his mercy, and somehow he's missed it. And it's Zayek. Good challenge, he just stood firm. De Ligt goes on a charge down the left. Fires from distance. Cristiano Ronaldo quickly realised that he could have a pop. Not his best. In with the challenge. Still inseparable. We have penalties. Look, I've been in this position myself, and after a grueling game, you don't want to back down if the manager asks you to take a penalty for fear of appearing weak. Uh, you can't let fatigue cloud your judgment. Well, the players look exhausted, but one last act. We're back in a moment for penalties. It is so important to score the first one. Oh, he's missed it, he's hit the post! Oh, we're talking inches, such are the, uh, the fine margins. Promise steps up for his penalty. No, it's been saved! I think the keeper's done really well to save that, and he deserves a pat on the back from his teammates. Oh, good take, keeper committed himself. Good penalty, completely wrong-footed the keeper. Keeper's read that beautifully. Oh, that's a super save from the keeper. Juventus looking to extend their advantage. Coolly into the bottom corner. And the lead is two. Ajax trailing by two now. Great stop, keeper's denied him. That's a lovely stop from the keeper, he's done his teammates proud with that one. A huge spot kick here. And he cannot settle it. Oh, what a miss, and that would have sealed the win for them. Ajax have to score, or they have had it. Oh, nerveless! How confident was that? Backed himself all the way. Calmly, he puts the ball down on the spot. Kadira just needs to keep his nerve here. I oh, saved it! Well, the keeper's done brilliantly to keep his eye on the ball and makes it a great save. So it's down to him to keep it alive. That's it! It is done! So the final now awaits. Delirium in the stands. The fans know that they will get their big day. What are your thoughts on today's game then, Jim? Yeah, they've grown in stature and confidence with every step, and one big step away from the trophy now. Well, welcome everybody, you join us here for our coverage of what is set to be a truly exciting final. Formalities are underway, everybody is soaking up an energetic, highly charged atmosphere within the ground. The teams will be with us very shortly, we look forward of course to that special moment. In the meantime, we take in 
the feeling of excitement and euphoria ahead of what should be a really outstanding final. This one of the great amphitheatres of the game. You are welcome to it and indeed to one of the grandest fixtures. Two teams, Jim Beglin, with one common thought, to have their names on this famous trophy. Bringing back memories for me, Peter. A chance to have your name in the club's history. Having had the privilege of experiencing this uh, a fair few times in my own career, there really is nothing that compares. Once you get there, you want to keep coming back. I still feel like that now. Well, this is it. As with a lot of finals, caution plays a big part in the opening stages, but an early goal can blow all that away, so I hope that we can uh, create a, a, an attacking contest here, which, which obviously we want for this showpiece. Cristiano Ronaldo! He's got a rattle, and that's exactly the type of adventure we want to see in a final two, Peter. It's Cristiano Ronaldo! What a start, and what a contribution from the main man. I had a feeling he might do something, given his reputation, but to do it like that, absolutely brilliant. I wasn't expecting that. Juventus are looking strong on the break. Winning the ball in midfield is one thing, but it's the clever use of counter-attacking. That's the real highlight. Big occasion, big goal, crucial lead. Well, certainly the big occasion and a very big opening goal to boost everyone's confidence here. Looking crossfield, changing the point of attack. Genduzzi. This is promising. A sliding tackle. Oh, he's brought him down and it is a penalty. And that is a huge moment in the context of the game. Well, it was deliberate, it was cynical, and you have to understand the frustration of, of being denied a clear opportunity, but it had to be done. Brilliant save from Buffon! He can't put it away. Oh, Peter, I, I'm not a great reader of body language, but I didn't like the way he walked up to that. A oh, smart save. And it's Papastathopoulos. Oh, that is lovely footwork. De Ligt tries to get it forward quickly. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Arsenal have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. He's tried one. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal, and he didn't go for the back heel. He'll try from distance. Gave it a go, but off target. Cristiano Ronaldo came up with a, a decent crack, but he knew rather quickly he'd gotten underneath it. Kolasinac plays it over to the other flank. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Driving on now, what can they conjure from here? He gets past his man. Cristiano Ronaldo! 
and he nearly went all the way. What a chance, a huge chance. He couldn't have set it up any better. Renat Xhaka. And Tibola! Oh, that's a fine save! Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. Cristiano Ronaldo is an obvious threat from set pieces. He needs special attention. Great leap! Defence has got rid of that. This is gone, and we've reached the halfway point of the final. So there you have it, a close sport half of football that might have still had its moments and ultimately produced just one goal. A more than decent game up to now. And he has been fouled there. Ramsey, and the shot! Oh, denied brilliantly! Ramsey is very sporting here to acknowledge the quality of the save. A lovely little footballing moment. Quick pull forward. Pjanic. Ganduzi. Hector Bayerin. And here's Aubameyang. Aubameyang! Oh, that is asking for trouble. Maitland-Niles pumps it into the area. Hoists it forward. Dybala has a hit! Oh, what a hit! What a hit! That is a gem! An absolute gem! And with that goal comes comfort! The purest possible contact. What a fabulous strike. That was just the top draw finish. He was always in control and couldn't have placed it any better. Juventus take a two-goal lead, and things should be comfortable from here on in. The turning of the screw comes to mind, Peter. They've got them where they want them. Wolf loose, who's getting there? This could spell... He's had a goal! Oh, fine stop from the keeper. Aubameyang sparked a tremendous stop there, and I think it's fair to add, he just wasn't expecting it. Some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Gets up to head it! There it is! Great corner, and he did the rest. Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch, and it was fully deserved. He gave it everything he had. a game here. Well, it was important they didn't get ahead of themselves and lose their discipline. This game plan could near well reward them with an equaliser. Oh, good ball. Oh, he's been bundled over. That is a foul. Arsenal are definitely going about this the right way. Oh, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Spot on, Peter. Now it's Dybala. Dybala. This is promising. Going through. It's Cristiano Ronaldo! And that would have been game, set and match. Cristiano Ronaldo was totally aware of how that chance could have impacted on the game. And that should have gone in.
Arsenal can make their change now with uh, a break in play. Yeah, it's pretty obvious as to who is going to be taken off. His energy levels began to, to sag, and he was never going to last until the final whistle. And it's Papastathopoulos. It really is now or never. They need a goal however it comes. Foul and a free kick in a very dangerous area. And he is going into that little black book. Well, some of the players here are letting their emotions get the better of them. They do have to be careful. This must not be inflamed any further. Well, what possessed them to do that, Peter? I have no idea. It's, uh, it's not in keeping with the quality of the performance. Shaka! And they've been caught out here. Question of running down the clock now. Now it's Dybala. He's got away. Chance. And the shot! That has certainly tested the keeper. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. come loose and with that the final whistle Juventus are the winners the ceremony is fitting their triumph has been beautiful indeed so on to centre stage come the central characters the individuals who as a team blended into champions and this is their moment